deal Morgan Freeman is walking yeah. behind us right now. It's so funny. I'm like, so cool. Oh my god. Yeah. Like that we're not. Yeah. Wow. Oh, you walk right behind you. Right. <laughs> yeah. You know. That just is Morgan so cool. Freeman. I feel like I like jumped inside of a movie screen or something, yeah. and then all of a sudden I'm like, oh, we're all we're all just, just hanging out together. Oh, no, just like everyone. Just everyone. <laughs> it's really cool. It's beyond it's, amazing. This is the cool thing about award shows that have television and film is that you get to see your favorite TV right. and, and movie stars, right. which yeah. is so cool. So cool. We, oh. Yeah, I was standing in line in front of one of the kids from Stranger Things, and like normally, if it was like a comedian or something, I'd be like, oh, I, miss me. I can't even speak. I know. I'm like, I I'm a little starstruck. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely starstruck by like people in TV dramas. This is what ends up <laughs> happening. I, I, I automatically have to be like, hi, my name is my name is Kimmy Gay, but I'm on Glow. It's a wrestling show. It's on Netflix. Like I have to start. No way. But all. by the way, no. But you guys are doing an incredible, incredible job right now. And I mean, the show is awesome. It's so inspiring too. And like, what does it feel like to be working on a show like that in the midst of Hollywood just changing forever? I mean, this is the biggest transition we've ever seen. I would say the most interesting thing: the show takes place in the '80s, and you realize that things have not changed that much in terms of where women are and our relationship to sex and power and money and and uh, I think that that's eye-opening is to look at it like we can address these topics head-on because it's in a different time but yeah and we're allowed to actually like say it out loud and you know even just the title of the show gorgeous ladies of wrestling like I don't know if that would fly yeah. if you were just if you were making a female wrestling show like just straight up I feel like it wouldn't be all just about you know and like those women were warriors they're inspirational and and I feel like uh, it's so cool to get to portray like some of their experiences and actually learn how to wrestle and so it's been in an incredible way to get out our rage for what's going on in the world. <laughs> also you would think something like wrestling would be so campy. I mean we're in leotards it doesn't seem like something that yeah. would be empowering but having lived actually the same life that the women did at, from GLOW you really understand why they would do it and you feel like a badass. Yeah. We call ourselves warrior princesses. It is so so much work yeah, and they don't get performing stunts. Absolutely. You're performing stunts but you don't this know what the next thing is going to be. Bruise. Yeah. Makeup. I have, I have spray tan and makeup covering my bruise and my legs are covered in bruises. And it's, it's just because, you know, we're shooting the finale yeah, right now yeah, and like moves. it just happens, yeah. you know, when you're I don't know, jumping off of ropes and flinging yourself out of right, a ring. Right, yeah, when you're like dragging each other out of the ring and like it's it's really honestly so fun and I didn't I thought it was going to be harder. I thought I was going to not be good at it. And so then the fact that I actually could do it was amazing. And you guys never did it before. So when you auditioned, did they have you do any any moves? No, not no, in the but audition. No, what we did do, Rebecca did do a jump split, I and, I, and I did a prat fall. I flipped, threw myself against the wall and yeah. fell on the ground. We leaned hard into our comedy yes. skills. Yes, I really did a jump split. And we're looking for best friends in comedy duos, and I don't know how many are out there. <laughs> and we're so happy we had the opportunity because, yeah. I mean, we feel like this part was like, it just grabbed us, and, and we're all a bunch of misfits in this cast, and it yeah. came at the right time in our personal lives as well. So yeah. What's next for you guys? What are you working on? Well, we're trying to work on, on our own show that we're writing, so we're working on that right now, and, uh, you know, hopefully... We're directing and producing. Yeah. I have some shorts coming out with Rachel Bloom for Planned Parenthood, so be on the lookout for those. Yeah. Wow, congratulations. Thank Very you. nice meeting you both. Nice Thank you.